Anita. Ajay, Longinus said this was from you. Thank you. Thanks, brother. He also said the opium at the old tea factory was ready to ship. We need to wipe that poison out. Wipe it out? Are you joking? We need to secure that shipment and those fields. Amita, we talked about this. Turning Kirat into a drug stake is not the answer. Sabal, we have no natural resources. What happens when we're free? The mines have been stripped, the fields have been ruined for years. So we liberate our people, then what? It's not our way, it never was. You do this, you're no better than Pagan. It's morally bankrupt. Better than being literally bankrupt.
Everything's burning! He's not here anymore. Going for the mounted gun! Understood! Moving out! Go! 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 I got nothing. But I bet it's more rebels messing with us. Could be an ambush. Look around! Find out if there's something there! Find out what caused it! Hold on, hold on! Could be more than one person. What? Respect to the families. I have never seen anything like this. Well, I've never seen anyone carry around their mother's ashes. <laughs> yeah. Do you think my father's funeral was like this? I was too young. But I know his death broke the golden path. Things would be different now if he died fighting. But he didn't. He was murdered. Murdered? Oh wait, what what happened? All I know is that he was killed in his house east of Banapur. It's still there. Maybe you could go there and find out more about him. Just be careful. That area belongs to Noah now. I have to go. That's an archaic term. It still means disavow. What? Like flammable and inflammable? Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh! Om Nam Shiva, Om Nam Shiva, Om Nam Shiva. Om Nam Shiva, Om Nam Shiva. Welcome, my brother. 
You've come to a place of peace, where the demons of modern life cannot reach you. You are safe here. My friend, Nam Shiva, Nam Shiva, comes from afar, seeking, seeking answers. We can give him those answers. For a nominal fee. Right, nothing in life is free. I'm sensing... We are sensing. We are sensing. You want to know who we are? Right, I'm Yogi, and this is Reggie. But you, stranger, you... You're the son of a legend. I see a world of danger and, and, and a mother with a black in heart. Hey, J. Gale. Welcome to Kuru Ashram. What, what are you doing here? This is my parents' house. Why don't you guys get out? Oh, what? Why does he want us to get out? I don't know. Ask him. You ask him. Hey, I'm right here. Oh, he's right here. Good for him. He knows where he is. <laughs> oh, okay, welcome. Come in. Yeah, after all, to casse, to casse. Um... We'll clean up. We'll be we'll be out momentarily. But first, let's uh, have a little beast pipe where we hash out the details. You're into this sort of thing, right? You know what I think I'm okay. So what are you guys doing here anyway? Ah, uh, AJ, we represent the interests of a certain power broker. Right, she'd like to press the flesh, as it were, a little meat and greet. You being the meat. Well, we tried the carrot. Guess he wants the stick then. <laughs> hey! What the f fuck?
walk with me. You, you tried to kill me. And now I'm not. You know what? Fuck you. Stop. Wait here. Just listen, please. Paul has my family. Until I know they're safe, I'm trapped here doing whatever Pagan wants me to do. What does this have to do with me? The Golden Path wants Paul dead. I need my family safe. We can help each other. How? I can get you back into a stronghold. Oh, and AJ. Take it easy on Reggie and Yogi. They're being played, just like you and I. to give you a tour of my vaults one day. Right now, I'm looking at all the wealth of Kirat. Gold medallions, ivory statues, jade carvings, such delightful trinkets. The Golden Path says I stole its wealth, but I did no such thing. They robbed themselves for centuries instead of putting it to good use. I, on the other hand, have been selling off whatever I can to the West, and whatever I can't, I melt it down and make something a little more... Contemporary. There's the lesson for you, Arte. People are hypocrites and they all want someone to blame for their shit-filled lives. And they never want to accept their share of the responsibility. The next time they are whining about building schools or clinics, remember, they've been hiding away their fortune in dusty old monasteries for centuries. trouble and it's yogi you cunt i still want to shoot you both uh, listen i don't blame you for wanting to put a hole in reggie here fuck fuck it we're trapped in this bloody country like you or i can nick no passports and they're getting us to fuck over folks like you and we can't go back to india after that incident with the cow cows are uh, right cows are uh, oh, so many cows she yeah, has 10 million hits on youtube so far really yeah it was okay look look, look, look. we we, we, we thought no one wanted to pull eh? We didn't think she was gonna throw you in the arena naked. Yes, we did. That's why you bet against him. 
I only technically bet against him. I, I was trying to cover the spread, my old China. He means mate. I, however, had no doubt. I bet on you, mate. Check it out. Which I'm more than willing to split with you. Uh, 60 40. 40 60. 37. Right, just take the whole lot. You deserve it. Fighting with your tackle flip flopping about. Yeah. Oh, we're very impressed. With his tackle? With his fighting tit? He was very glad to get it. I would say more 300. I want you two gone. I want you out of my house. I'm taking it back. And if you ever. We'll shoot Donald together. It's Yogi. Smoke? Leave. Alright. Just, just give us a second to pack. Yeah, we're nesters. It's a bit of a mess. <sighs> but first. So what used to be here? One of those thankers? Yes, clever clocks. What happened to it? Now that is a story worth telling. Yeah, drugs, intrigue, danger, it's all there. I just want the short version. Fine, the short version. We were new arrivals in Kairat. Fresh off the boat, so to speak. Yes, and we were eager to sample the local horticulture scene. Very eager. We were not disappointed. No, not in the slightest. And it was all thanks to an, uh, a kindly old guru who helped open our minces. Right. That day, we reached a level of herbal nirvana unlike any other. When it was all said and done, we asked the guru who his supplier was. That's when we heard of Shangri-La. Shangri-La. <laughs> it's like a... The ghost of ancient Kairat. Ancient Kairat. And yeah, it's, it's more like the ghost that never was. So it's like Schrodinger's cat. <laughs> Schrodinger's Kairat. <laughs> Guys, the short version, right? Right, back on track. Um, so the guru told us he had journeyed to a story place, and when he was there, he nipped a few butts. This was all made possible through a mystical thanker that hung on this very wall. So what happened to it? Uh, it was torn to pieces and scattered throughout Kairat by persons unknown. Yeah, right. But not to worry. The old geezer sold us a map that ah. led to a cave not far from right, here. Right, a cave with a scary door. Right, really scary. As much as we wanted to chase that dragon, the door had a certain uh, do not enter sort of quality to it. So where's the map? I think we used it as a rolling paper, but no worries. It, it, the cave is easy to find. You just head west from it. Yeah, right. And when you find a door with a really scary face on it, you know you're in the right place. Oh, yeah, and bring us back a few buds, yeah?
रास्ता लंबा और कठिन रहा मैंने बहुत कुछ देखा किया लेकिन मैं चाहता हूं कि ऐसा किसी और के साथ कभी ना हो लेकिन मैं मूर्ख था जो सोचता था कि स्वर्ग दुखों से मुक्त होता है देखा था वो एक दूसरी दुनिया से था एक रक्षक एक भीम के जानवर के दांतों से अटका रक्षा कर रहा था लेकिन किससे शैतानों ने शैंग्रीला पर आक्रमण किया इस धरती की नहीं 
साफ मन के नहीं कोई खुद या कोई चीज अपने लिए शंग्रिला को चुराना चाहती थी जाने के लिए नहीं बल्कि एक सहयोगी पाने के लिए के साथ बड़ा हुआ हूं लेकिन इनको देखकर ऐसा लगा कि ये देवताओं के लिए बनाए गए हो वो इतने बड़े थे के लिए मेरा मार्गदर्शन कर रहा था
बच्चा था तो मेरे पिता मुझे शैंग्रिला की घंटियों की कहानियां सुनाया करते थे उनकी धवानियां धरती से बुराइयों को दूर करती थी वो मुझे चेतावनी देते थे तुम अपने माता पिता का कहना नहीं मानोगे तो घंटियों की धुआनियां तुम्हें ढूंढ देंगी मैं उनसे बहुत डर जाता था इस भय का शिकार मैं अकेला ही नहीं था in holding a bank up. Right. And then you put it up in a frame here and then curled up on the floor for a kit. Yeah. You want to try it. You're speaking a weird language. <laughs> what happened? I don't know, but it was fucking weird. Mm. Was that here when you moved in? Oh. This? I was told that it's a Gale family heirloom. Been passed down for generations. <sighs> Did I not mention that earlier? No, you didn't. Ask for the show version. Right, and we asked you to grab some of that wacky back here, eh? Uh, Did you find any? I was a little busy. Right, but yeah, that's good. Yeah, 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 no worries. Yeah, yeah. Next time. But you do come across that fanker. Keep us in mind. Right. Well, we're off. We'll send someone back here to clean up the rest of our shit. Alright? Alright. Toodles! Toodles! <laughs> <laughs> 